So in this video, we are going to take a look at how to easily trace um, your pattern onto the fabric that you want to use. So just get your fabric um, into your embroidery hoop and make sure there aren't any wrinkles in it. It's stretched out really nice. And then lay the fabric flat onto the paper with the pattern that you're going to be tracing. Um, and this will make it show straight through so that you'll be able to easily trace over it with a pen or a pencil. Um, sometimes when I'm stitching, I will actually, if I'm tracing the pattern, um, I'll leave the fabric like this in the hoop, the way that you're seeing it right now, and just stitch it straight away without flipping it over to the front. And then once I'm completely done, if I'm going to be framing it in the embroidery hoop, then I'll flip the, fab the fabric around so that it's um, facing forward, the, the part that I've stitched on. Um, that just helps to make sure that the pattern that I've worked so hard to trace isn't distorted um, whenever I flip it around to the front. Because sometimes whenever you do that and then you are stretching out the fabric to make sure there aren't any wrinkles you can kind of distort the pattern a little bit which wouldn't be good so this is an option if you're not worried about that then you can definitely trace it like this and then flip it around um, but I hope this was helpful it gives you an idea of how to trace your patterns if you are looking for a new embroidery project you can head, or, head over to www.thistleandtheaddesign.com and you'll find a pattern shop there with lots of patterns that you can either purchase to download and print them off on paper like this and trace them or there are kits available that have the patterns already printed onto the fabric so you can skip this step entirely but I hope this was helpful and if you have any questions go ahead and leave them in the comments and thanks for watching